June 25 Ad, Liu Xiu was declared emperor in Hebei, the Han dynasty was rebuilt, the capital was soon moved to Luoyang, because the capital was located in the east of Chang'an, the former capital Han dynasty, it was later known as the Eastern Han dynasty, until 36 Ad, after 12 years of hard war, Liu Xiu finally calmed down the China, reunify a divided China, Liu Xiu, probably the most underrated founding emperor in history, he not only has the ability to heroically break the enemy, moreover he can cultivate people's livelihood, and strive for good governing, he soon put the Eastern Han Empire on track, he is really a first class, all-round talent among the emperors of China, February, 57 Ad, Liu Xiu, the Emperor Guangwu of Han, who reigned for 32 years, died. He was 62 years old. Liu Xiu was very lucky, but what Liu Xiu never expected was the luck for future generations. It seems that it was also exhausted by Liu Xiu. The Eastern Han Dynasty seemed to be cursed after Liu Xiu's death. His fourth son ascended the throne. It is Liu Zhuang, the Emperor Ming of Han. Liu Zhuang reigned for 18 years, he was diligent in the political office, and did something good for his people, he was 48 years old at the time of his death, after Liu Zhuang's death, his fifth son ascended the throne, it is Liu Da, Emperor Zhang of Han, Liu Da is honest and filial piety, quite benevolent, he ruled with his father Liu Zhuang, it is collectively known as, the reign of Ming Zhang. Liu Da reigned for 13 years, he died early at the age of 33, after Liu Da's death, his fourth son ascended the throne, it was Liu Zhao, Emperor He of Han. Liu Zhao was only 10 years old when he ascended the throne, but he was exceptionally intelligent and thoughtful, when he was 14 years old. He designed to wipe out the consort Qin and very soon, he regained imperial power then, he chose meritocracy to make the government relax, review the recitals late every night never absurd. During this period, the national power of the Eastern Han Dynasty reached its peak, it was called, Prosperity of Yanyuan in the history, however Liu Zhao died suddenly in 105 Ad, after his death, his son Liu Long ascended the throne, at this time Liu Long was just 100 days from birth, Liu Long died at the age of 2, it is the Emperor Shang of Han, Liu Long thus became, one of the Chinese emperors, minimum age of accession, and the emperor with the shortest lifespan, after Liu Long's death, Liu Hu, one grandson of Liu Da, the Emperor Zhang of Han, ascended the throne, he became the sixth emperor of the Eastern Han Dynasty, it was called Emperor N of Han, this year, Liu Hu just turned 13 years old, for most of Liu Hu's reign, he had not got the opportunity to be pro-go, earnment, Liu Hu was only 32 years old when he died, Liu Hu had only one son, Liu Bao, however after Liu Hu's death, Empress Dowager Yanji wanted to control the country, she did not let Liu Bao take the throne deliberately, but choose another grandson of Liu Da, Liu Yi to be the emperor, but Liu Yi was very short-lived, he died of illness after only about 200 days after being the emperor, at this time, Liu Bao staged a coup with the help of eunuchs, drove away Empress Dowager Yanji, successfully ascended the throne, who is called Emperor Shun of Han. Liu Bao has a weak personality, governing mainly relied on eunuchs, he died at the age of 30, his son Liu Bing ascended the throne, it was Emperor Cheng of Han, but a few months later, Liu Bing fell ill and died, he was only 3 years old, after Liu Bing's death, under the support of Lian Ji, a powerful minister of the consort Qin, one great-great-grandson of Emperor Zhang of Han, Liu Zhuan, ascended the throne, who is called Emperor Zhu of Han. Liu Zhuan was only eight years old when he succeeded to the throne, but he was gifted and intelligent precocious. In mind, Liang Ji feared that he would be uncontrollable as he grew older, therefore after poisoning Liu Zhuan to death, 
he made Liu Zhu to be the emperor. Liu Zhu was another great grandson of Liu Da. After Liu Zhi's succession, he same relied on the power of eunuchs, eradicated Lian Ji, and other powerful minister of the consort Qin. Therefore, during Liu Zhi's reign, eunuchs ravaged the imperial government and corruption. Liu Zhu himself was absurd and unrestrained. At the age of 36, he died. He is called Emperor Huan of Han. Since he had no sons, he had to be established as another great great grandson of Liu Da. It is Liu Hong, the Emperor Ling of Han. During the reign of the Emperor Ling, he was content with pleasure and ignored political affairs. He tried to make Ms. Her to be the Empress. Her Jin, the eldest brother of the Empress, was also named as the Great General. At this point, it is not difficult to find out the Eastern Han Dynasty. In fact, a vicious circle has entered. The Emperor was short-lived, and the little Emperor ascended the throne only by the Empress Dowager. The Empress Dowager took over power, definitely reused her brothers and nephews. This forms the strength of the force of the Consort Kin. After the little Emperor was erected by the Consort Kin, as the little Emperor grow up, if he want to be pro-government, he can only rely on the people closest to him, that is the Unic. With the expansion of the power of eunuchs, it would also have an impact on the power of the Emperor. If the Emperor wanted to truly grasp the power, he had to rely on his ministers, cultivate his own power among the bureaucrats, and build up his own prestige in order to suppress the eunuchs and that are factions of power, and to realize the power of freedom. But most of the emperors of the Eastern Han Dynasty were short-lived. They often died before that day comes, so another little emperor ascended the throne. The new Empress Dowager came to the dynasty, the new consort Kin has grown again, and so on and so forth, finally led the Eastern Han Dynasty into the abyss. 184 Ad, the Yellow Turban Rebellion broke out, in the process of suppressing the uprising, the power of the warlords began to rise rapidly. Five years later, in April 189 Ad, the 33-year-old Emperor Ling of Han, passed away. So the Unic forces, and the Consort Kin forces, the Minister's forces and Warlord forces, together opposites, or alliances, intrigue or fights. The curtain of the chaotic era of the late Han Dynasty was slowly opened.